Hey everyone! So today I'm gonna do a video, a review video about my Coach file bag. So this is the bag. I got this in the black signature canvas material with the silver hardware and black leather strap and trimmings. So I got this bag for about 6,000 Philippine pesos. I believe that's about 125 in US dollars. I got this from an on online seller on Instagram. Her name is Just For Girls PH. So I'm just gonna put her name in the description box below so you guys can check her out. So this bag is. I love this bag actually. It's very thin, but. You can put a lot of things inside without being it too bulky. So the features of this bag is that it has a big pocket on the outside and then the main compartment. It has a zipper closure and then in the main compartment you have a zippered pocket in the back and then two slip pockets in the front. I'm not sure if you can see this but this is one and then two and then um, it has the coach creed in the zipper pocket at the back. So on the inside it's lined in um, fabric. I'm not sure if you can see that but it has little ridges there and it's very thick so yeah and of course it features the long strap for crossbody and for shoulder use shoulder wear I mean sorry <laughs> and it has one two three four five five holes that you can adjust so I believe this is the new um, logo or tag or I'm not sure what you really call this but before it's just like the letters coach but now they replaced it with a with an oblong plate in the front and then of course it also comes with the leather tag that says coach coach New York there so I love the hardware on this one it's silver shiny hardware yeah. okay so for the inclusions of this bag I believe just for girls PH um, buys her bags from buys her stuff from the outlet in Florida in the US so when you buy the coach items from the outlet they seldom provide you with a dust bag or a paper bag or anything um, they just provide you with with the plastic packaging together with the stuffings inside and it came in with this one I'm not sure what you call this but this is wrapped all around the the handles the hardware um, also the this leather tab right here it's also very well protected so that's what I like about the items from just for girls ph because i this is i believe this is my my fourth or yeah my my this is my third purchase the fourth one is the bag that my mom got i i ordered it for her from yeah from just for girls ph as well and everything all the items that i got from her are very well packaged Everything is very well protected, complete with the stuffings inside and yeah, the protection for all the hardwares and the zippers.
so about that um, there's also I, I also want to include this in this video that I believe a lot of imitations and or replicas are are being sold online here in the Philippines so if you buy online just make sure to ask for a receipt because that is really where you can check out if the product is authentic so with the receipt you just have to check if the item number or the style number matches the the num the style number in the receipt and also in your tags because in the tags it has the item number in there it's not gonna focus how there there's the item number there and the color that you chose there's the barcode and there's the manufacturer's um, suggested retail price I guess so the original price of this bag is 225 US dollars but I only got it for 125 so that's a big bargain actually then it also came with the care instructions so with the packaging in the plastic that this one came in I um, it has also the item number stated there so this is one of the things that you can check out if the the bag is really authentic so it has this sticker that has the item number and the, the color that you chose for for that particular bag as well it also has the barcode that is actually the same as the bag that is attached to the bag so the the barcode the item number and the color is very uniform and if you ask for the copy of the receipt from the seller um, the item number and all the details in here should be the same as well there so just a heads up um, coach coach factories are usually here in Asia they usually have factories in Cambodia uh, Myanmar Vietnam China and also here in the Philippines I think they have just opened a factory here I'm not sure if that was around last year or two years ago they opened a factory here I believe it is based in Pampanga or I don't know just don't quote me on that but yeah they have a factory here and even Miss Karina Sanchez featured it on her Rated Gay um, program so if if you if you ever buy a bag a coach bag online that says that it is made in the Philippines so don't doubt it that fast or just ask for another um, like proof from the seller that the actual bag that you have purchased is authentic for example yeah, the receipt as I've said a while ago so let's see if this bag was made in where oh yeah it's made in China this one mine is made in China so yeah anyway on to the review so I've already featured the I've already said the features of this bag and then we're gonna do the measurements so for the height we have 10 inches and then for the length we have 11 inches two and a half inches in width and then the strap drop I currently have it in the longest setting 22 inches so that's the that's the longest that you can go with this bag 
I want to show you what can fit inside this bag just to give you an idea of what you can bring with you when you use this bag. So I have here my daily essentials. I have my mini pochette, my brush. Um, it's a full size brush but it's foldable. And then my six ring key holder, uh, full size pack of tissues. And then my Josephine wallet. This is a full size wallet. And then a notebook. And my Tic Tacs. Presenting Bob the Minion. <laughs> These are banana flavored Tic Tacs. So, yeah. And then a small bottle of alcohol. The lipstick that I will be using for the day. Oil control sheets. And. A mirror okay so let's put this inside just to give you an idea oh and also I have my cell phone by the way the note for so opening the back up I love the zippers on push bags it's on par with Louis Vuitton zippers actually so yeah so let's put in the notebook you can put it um, horizontally or vertically whichever you prefer this is just the regular size notebook standard one tissues mini pochette josephine wallet a six ring key holder i will just put it in one of the pockets there it fits perfectly a hairbrush um, take that. Okay, oil control sheets and my mirror. Let's put it on the other pocket in here. Lipstick. Alcohol. So you see, I didn't put anything on the zippered pocket because I, I don't really feel the need to do so so you have your notebook your tissues your mini pochette excuse me rd2 your mini pochette your brush your uh, my tic tacs the alcohol is back there beside the tic tac and then your six ring six ring key holder beside the lipstick and then your um what's call this your oil control film and then your mirror so for my cell phone i just put it in the front pocket just for easy access there you go then let's just zip it up it zips no problem it's still really thin And the bag itself is very light, so when you put a lot of stuff inside, um, most of the weight comes from the things that you put in. It's not from the bag. So I will give you some modeling shots at the end of this video. So yeah, that's it. Um, this is the Coach Signature File Bag in the black with silver hardware. And yeah, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and have a great day. Bye!